Hello, my name is Wayne Godso from the Avaya Serviceability Engineering Team. This tech tip will cover the steps to change the system time on the Avaya VSP9000 system. In our tech tip example, we will use the following steps to change the system time on the VSP9000. We'll log into the system with read write all privileges using our RWA user account and RWA password. We'll enter terminal configuration mode by entering enable followed by conf t. We'll change the current system time using the clock set command followed by the current month, day, year, hour, minute, and seconds. We'll set the time zone to Eastern Standard Time using the clock time zone command. We'll save our current configuration changes with the save config command. And finally, we'll verify our system time is correct using the show clock command. In our example, we'll log into the console with the read write all user account and password. Now we'll enter enable, followed by conf t to enter terminal configuration mode. Now we'll change our current system time with the clock set command. We'll define our month, the day, the year, the hour, the minute, and the second. Now we'll set the time zone using the clock time zone command. In our example, we'll set the time zone to Eastern Standard Time. Now we'll save our configuration changes using the save config command. Finally, we'll verify our system time settings with the show clock command. From the output of the command, we can verify that the time, date, and time zone have been set correctly. As you can see, changing the system time on the Avaya VSP9000 is a quick and easy process. You should set your system time when deploying all new Avaya VSP9000 systems. Thank you for your time today. We hope this information was useful. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentor.avaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. Thank you for choosing Avaya.